party of Navy Archie Baja. Hanging out today, playing some American Truck Simulator. And you guys, today of all days, I am so excited to uh, record this game because earlier this week, I got my hands on a Logitech G25 racing wheel, pedals, and shifter. Now, I know G25 ain't exactly the best shifter or steering wheel for uh, this game because there's just so many uh, controls that you need. But that would make it work because they would get the uh, basics, really. And uh, I've been playing around with it, you guys, and I am loving this shifter so much. With my truck here, I've actually got it set up with a uh, 13 speed, and it is so much fun to drive. I may notice uh, all my trucks have done some uh, changes like right here on the air filters. I got some lights, I changed out the stacks, got them flat top stacks. I didn't it uh, dolled up a little bit, I think I also changed out the bumper. Pretty sure I did. Yeah, changed the bumper. I got lights running the bumper now. So it's coming together. Um, I wanted to get uh, some more money. And actually paint this truck. I got a really, really nice paint scheme that I want to go with. Um, I want to go with white and baby blue. I do love white and baby blue. I might go with a little, a little turquoise maybe. Try to play around with that later and see how do I want to go with. Uh, I got some hubcaps I'd love to put on here, but I'm not high enough level for them yet. It's going to take me a little while to uh, do that. So, uh, yeah. So we're going to go ahead and uh, get into this. I think I'm already driving on uh, one. Okay, I didn't even uh, take off nowhere. Okay, so I, like I said before, I got 13 speed. Now I'm in one. Two. Shifting, but I'll be for later, so come back down into first. Go good. No better than to come this way. This place is always clogged up with traffic. Now, 
far lane after it, I'm good. some pedals slid out from underneath me right there. Got hardwood floors in my room, in my office little area. Okay, let's try that again. That was almost bad. Gotta back it up a little bit. Hopefully I don't back into nobody. That might be good right there. Okay, long. Ah, oh, dang it, dang it. Trailer's on go. Downshift. 
probably wouldn't have been so bad if they gave me a little more of a heads up. Okay, neutral. Sparking brake. 66,000 pounds. Okay, we start first. I've actually got, got tickets by going through here too fast.
the gang there to drive like most people around here. That's why I'm glad I live in a little small, small park community. Now, as soon as I go in town, I get road rage. Bad. Well, I guess that's why I don't go to town. Other than for work, I go, go home, work, back home. I don't go anywhere else. Man, I am making some freaking money now. Bought me another little truck and driver. Ooh, ooh. Staying lane. Got another, another truck and driver, so. And the truck was pretty cheap. So, went ahead and got that. Got a little bit extra money coming in now. That thing, if you can get it set up good, that thing is a horse. And you can get a uh, low, low gear transmission. I think the lowest one's like a 444. No, probably 570. 570 might be the lowest. And then, crap, one to 335 horse motors. That thing put out like 1,600 foot pounds of torque. And for those of you that don't know what that means, that's a lot of pulling power for a little old motor. In the 570, that's the transmission in the rear ends. That's a five, the drive shaft turns 570 times to the one rotation of the tires. I think that's how it is. It's, it's all about ratios, basically. Yeah, 
Way too fast. Is there a better way I could have gone? Not really serious, shortest. I get paid per mile, so I probably could have made more money by going through Reno, coming to Sacramento, then coming back up to Redding. Money wise, that probably would have been a better bet. But I'm on a little bit of time crunch. Okay, videos recorded. Thank you.
I'll be gonna try it. With this longer, this long frame like I got, getting it over in there is gonna be a bit of a trick. If I don't hang this track trailer right there on that brick pedestal, like I think I'm gonna. Pretty sure I did right there. Very bad idea. Damn man, very poor life choice. <sighs> Dang it, I know I'm getting tired. I get it. bumper off. back into my trailer. Let me tell you guys, I'm getting aggravated now. The stretch frame on this thing, yeah, it looks good. But dang, it's aggravating. You see that? Just like that.
Oh, that was so close. Yes! Finally! Oh, at last! Finally got it back in! I'm getting closer. Well, you guys, finally did it. Now, review of the G25 with this game. I'm liking it. I'm really, really enjoying it. One thing I would try fixing is the uh, centering for the game. All right, in the game, the steering will be centered, but in real life, you'll be having your wheel turn just a little bit to the left, to the right of me. You'll be turning a little to the right. Good thing is unfortunate. But if I were y'all, and y'all have this game, and you want to get a steering wheel with the shift and the pedals and all that, I would highly, highly recommend it getting the G27. The G25 works, but you don't have enough steering wheel buttons. All right, I don't have any. Don't have my wipers preset. Um, there's several other ones like my different, uh, my heads-up display. It goes through different stuff on it. I have nothing for that, so I gotta have my keyboard there next to me, which I'd rather not have. You know, I'd rather put my keyboard to the side so we can have more room right there. So that's one. I mean, that's. I guess you said nitpicking, but it makes things a lot easier if you have more buttons. And the way I got my shift and everything set up, like I said, 13 speed, from, to go from my low gears into my, I guess we'll call them medium gears, go from my low gears to my medium gears. I have it set, that splitter is, for, is uh, my left paddle shifter. Now I'm splitting from five low to five high. No, I'm going from medium, my medium gears to my high gears. Or in, in the game it says from low to high. Uh, I've got that splitter on the left. So for me, you now I've got everything right there. Makes things a little simpler for me. But in all, I'm enjoying it. You know? This is kind of why I got it, to help me whenever I get my CDLs. Because I am wanting to get my CDLs for work. And uh, I figured this is all enough for the driving part. This might help me out a little bit. Now, I'm willing to get anything, do anything for that little edge that I need. So that's all I'm doing for today, you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Thank, for, thank y'all for uh, riding along with me. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a hell and like button to show your support. And you can subscribe for more American Truck Simulator videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all next time.